So I'm just out for a wander around Elland where I've just moved to and there's an island here. I've known about it for years. I've gone past it for many years. This island here. It twists and turns all on its way virtually to Halifax, not the bottom end of Halifax. And there's only one area, well, as far as I can see, one spot you can get on. And that's over there by, if you can see the fence. I'll just walk down there. It's all locked up. Padlocks, chains, cameras all over the place. But I think that's just protecting the businesses that are there. But that island is pretty much untouched. And all there's loads of bays everywhere you can go and uh, camp next to the edge of the island. Next to water, should I say. Yes, yeah, good spot, unfortunately. Can't get there. So, another part of Elland, which I've always driven past. Always known about it, but never been here. A huge cliff face. It's like on top of that is Elland basically. <laughs> I've always thought, what's it, what would it be like to camp under here under this cliff face? This is the first time I've been up. I haven't been inside, so let's have a look together here. Eh? Well, this is pretty mad. Proper massive cliff face. Well, I'm under it, look. Pipe coming out of there. Loads of cans and the usual crap that you find thrown around places like this. Wow, well, check this out. <laughs> Mental. So we are right inside it. The hell. Like I said, I've never been in here before. I don't have a torch, so I can't see how far that goes in there. Whoa. I ain't going nowhere near that. That's far too narrow for me. I get freaked out waking up in a sleeping bag, never mind under some bloody rocks. Pretty mad nonetheless though. Top place. I'm glad I've come to ch uh, check it out. Look at that. Cool. You know, it's like a sort of prehistoric mouth. Top lip, bottom lip, tongue in the middle. Mad. Can anyone else see that? The prehistoric mouth. <laughs> There's a huge collection of birds, <laughs> collection, huge flock of birds flying over. I just uh, whipped my phone out to film them. But they all disappeared now. But yeah, I've walked all the way across this uh, cliff face. Really enjoyed that actually. It was quite, a, it was quite cool seeing uh, pretty much untouched stuff. There's not what goes on down here. I mean, there's a path here, but I don't think anyone's venturing over that side.
bad view there, I suppose. So, that was the cliff face. I have a good idea where I'm going to come out now. It's like I say, I work down here, so. I've got to say, them two people were pretty rude. I moved out of the way so they could uh, go past with the dog. I said, hi, you alright? Not a peep out of them. Not one little. Mm, not even a grunt. Honestly, some people. Rude. No time for rudeness. Little area called West Vale. Some nice little bars down there. Some decent pubs. Plenty of takeaways as well. And the Tesco Express. For all your Tesco needs. Yeah, you know what? I've got a good idea where I'm going to come out. I've never even been down here, but... Detection. And my uh, knowledge of the area. I believe I'm going to come down to where my uh, good friend Dan used to live. A house we used to call the Kennel. Because <laughs> <laughs> Dan looks like a greyhound. <laughs> and uh, we used to play darts there, so... We gave it a little name of the Kennel. Rough. <laughs> well, good times that. Good times. See this here? This is a COVID secure site. There's no COVID here. It's secure with COVID. People are two metres apart. You don't only see standing around who's two metres apart. And there's absolutely no COVID here whatsoever. Covid free zone this You don't get any Covid around here Oh look We're coming up to the end of the Covid zone The Covid free zone So we're Back in the Covid zone So basically Start living in uh, Roadworks, it's COVID free. See the dude just down the road there. Yeah, well, I got on about rude people earlier on. Again, I moved out of the way for him. He said, thank you. I said, no worries. He said, you're right. But yeah, not bad, thanks. Pleasant. So it's all about, isn't it? And it's about this too. Ellen Cricket Club. I was sat in a Spitfire in this field. Came to a ferry about four years ago. It was a Spitfire. I sat inside of it. I've got a picture of it. We sat there giving a salute. If I can find it, I'll put it on screen now. So I walked through the uh, entire cricket club. this wall and we can see you on the other side so I got over pretty much no worries to find this You might have noticed that I'm wearing the uh, German Army winter jacket. That's it. I can't put a floor in it at all. I ain't had one since I was a teenager, so I'm going back uh, over 20 years now. And uh, yeah, it's warm. Also, you can take out the fleece lining to make it lightweight so you can wear it in summer. It's cozy, nice big hood. There you go. <laughs> It'll work without my hat on. Yeah, can't afford it at all. I don't feel any cold at all, and it is, I think it's about one, two degrees today. Yeah, thumbs up for the German arms jacket. I 
was going to go walk that way. So that's probably the quickest way to my house. But I'm going to take a detour because that's just sheet ice that. I'm not going to bother even trying. I've got to a video walking down past some trees because it was quite nice. There were a lot of people standing around and I thought it might look a bit weird me just talking to myself. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to head back home. I'm not going to go mad with this video, I just thought I'd uh, make a little one to go on my YouTube page. Uh, I'll share it on Instagram as well, maybe a couple of camping groups. But yeah, if you watched it, I hope you enjoyed it tell some people to come and have a look at my channel. Well it's first Saturday uh, afternoon, I've had free for quite some time. Girls are at the friend's house, girlfriend's at her house, so I thought I'd go for a wonder. So like I say, keep an eye out on probably a couple of Facebook pages, my own, my own Facebook page, uh, Instagram and um, of course YouTube, yeah. I'll, look on there. I'll see you all very soon. Nice one, see you later on.